Hi Taurus, it's Leslie with your month forecast for November. Um, and it's a good month for you, it's a good month. Um, so it's a lazy month, but it's a good month. Thank you so much for all your wonderful comments and all your views of you and me and telling your friends about me. I know a lot of you have done that and we've had some new subscriptions, so I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Unavoidable delays start this month for you. There's an urge to balance opposite sides and opposing sides. Um, get the facts. Uh, sometimes you go off, Charles, sometimes you go off on a, a tangent or on your own where you don't have all the facts and you say what you think things are and not what they really are. So if you're going to address something, uh, address ethical in issues and make sure you uh, have the facts that you need. And I mean that very strongly because you've had some problems. Some of you have, not all of you, some of you had problems with that where you think something is one way and it really isn't at all because you don't have the facts. Around the 11th, someone offers worthwhile information uh, to you. Take this opportunity to greatly release the past and embrace the future. Well, let's go back to the information. There's information you've been seeking uh, about something that you maybe feel guilty of, you feel like maybe you did something wrong, hurt, hurt somebody, uh, could have caused some problems with people. Um, you're going to get the right information that this didn't happen that way. It did not happen that way. But that's why I say get the facts. Know really what would happen. Um, just because the internet says some things, it doesn't especially mean that's true. Um, and release the past. Take this opportunity. You have the opportunity very much, Tars, this month to um, release the past and embrace the future. And I mean release the past. You. You hold on to the past so much um, that you don't let the future in. So much of your life, no matter what age you are. Um, you, you, you know, you can't go forward if you're looking in the rearview mirror. That's all I can say. And it's up to you, and you seem to hold it more than anybody I know very strongly. Hold hurts and things, bad things that have happened, you hold them instead of going forward and being happy and spreading happiness around and knowing whatever's happened is a, is a lesson for you. It's a lesson for learning. Recycling and repurposing everything from decorations to gifts is worthwhile, and that's cleaning out, doing things. So you have, you have a vacuum for good things to come in and get rid of the old. Uh, and it's another thing you like to hold on to the old, whether it's a little bitty thing or it's a big thing. For what? For what reason? You know, um, for what reason? Think about it. Um, socialize with your friends. It's a good month for that. Uh, insight into other dimensions for you. Uh, be thinking very deeply. And you're a very strong thinker. Love is in the air, Taurus. Love is in the air for you. Very good. If you don't grab the brass ring this time, the merry-go-round, you know, the merry-go-round goes round and round, and that's where the brass ring usually is. And, in the horse's mouth. You need to grab them, grab it, and I'm talking about love. You need to grab this love and make it right, or it will be gone. After this month, it will be gone. It's just like uh, embrace the future, recycle, you know, forget the, release the past. Release the past. And if you don't do that, love is in the air, is good. But if you don't grasp the brass, grab the brass ring this time, you won't have it anymore. It will be something different. Uh, this is the last time to grab the brass ring. It really is. The arrival of an unmistakable message conveyed by an omen or dream brings a helpful message to you. Maybe this will help you do that. Around the 30th. Your best days are the 15th, the 16th, and the 27th. Let's see what the cards have in store for you. Um... Very nice cards, very nice spread here. Um, well, it seems like you've, you've been thinking about and wishing things. When you're really thinking about wishing things, um, it's good. You should do that. You should do that because what you wish for now, if you really believe in it, you may bring to you. It may not happen this month. It may be next month or the next, but it will. It's like like attracts like. It's like the law of attraction. Um, here you are, being yourself, being very. Um, mm, very strict, very stern, where you need to release all those feelings and, 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 and 
love and give love and give back and, and open yourself up to someone, to, to, to people to like you, to love you, to be their friends. Uh, you have a hard time doing that, Taurus, but I think you need to do that. Here you are, rushing in, maybe this is the same as a brass ring, I'm not sure. I hope it is for you or else it's going to be gone. And you will never, ever, re re you'll never, ever have that opportunity again. And it will be something you'll be sorry for all your life. Here we are, the winner. And you finally will do this, I believe, because see here, there's the love coming in. Being a wonderful love. Being able to have a relationship where you talk about things outside of outside of what you feel is right or wrong. Um, here's and you're a winner. You're the winner. And be sure and buy your lottery tickets. You might be a winner. It's very good. You're winning in a lot of things. Your self control, your self meaning. Um, there's someone here that um, I believe this has to do with your work. That you um. Mm, they don't like the work you're doing. They don't like it, so they want you to do do things differently. And you're not real sure if you want to do it that way. And your Knight of Cups is here, and he's 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 very much, he loves you very much. He could be this person, could be the Knight of Cups. He loves you, he's giving, he's romantic, he's a good communicator, and he does travel some. And Sue's going to pick your, your, your angel card, which is... Fantasy is the first step to success. So imagine things. Think of things being good. Have a wonderful month. Bye-bye.